friends, my name is Alyssa and I'm the science program manager here at Boston Children's Museum. And I want to welcome you to the museum. Today we are celebrating National Chemistry Week. And the theme this year is fast or slow, chemistry makes it go. And we're going to start by making a little boat that will be powered by chemistry. Here's the things that you'll need for today's activity. Some vinegar, baking soda, an empty water bottle or soda bottle or something like that, a funnel, a spoon, a straw, a tissue or some paper towel or even toilet paper or anything like that. And some tape or clay or something that you'll need to use to seal up around the straw to make sure no air gets through. You'll also need a grown-up to help you. First, like I said, get a grown-up to help you screw a hole into the cap. Put a straw into the hole so that most of the straw will be in the bottle when you screw the cap on. Then use some clay or your tape or hot glue or whatever it is that you have to get the straw sealed to the cap so that there's no air coming through the gap between the straw and the bottle cap. That's pretty good. Then pour some vinegar into your bottle. We're going to start with, I don't know, a couple inches worth. When you're doing this at home, you can try different amounts of vinegar and baking soda to see what gets you the best boat. Scoop some baking soda into your paper towel or tissue or whatever it is that you have and make a little packet. Okay, now we're going to head down the hall to our water exhibit to test our boat. Welcome to our Peeps World exhibit. In this exhibit, you can explore water and shadows and light. It's one of my favorite exhibits in the museum. This exhibit is the perfect place to test our boat because there's this great big tank of water for us to use. Let's get to it. Carefully push your little packet of baking soda into the neck of the bottle but not all the way in because you don't want it to go into the vinegar just yet. Put the cap on. Make sure that the straw goes all the way down into the vinegar and then give your bottle a shake to mix up the baking soda and vinegar together and watch your boat take off. Vinegar and baking soda are chemical opposites. Vinegar is an acid and baking soda is a base. And when you mix an acid and a base together, you're going to get some kind of reaction. When vinegar and baking soda are mixed, they react immediately and you get sodium acetate, which is a salt, not the salt you put on your popcorn, water, and carbon dioxide gas. It's that carbon dioxide gas that makes the bubbles. And the bubbles shooting out the straw at the back of your boat are what makes it go forward. Thanks for joining us today as we tried an experiment for National Chemistry Week. And I hope to see you back as we try even more experiments that prove, fast or slow, chemistry makes it go. If you enjoyed this experiment, don't forget to check us out on social media and subscribe to us on YouTube. Thanks, and I'll see you next time. There's one more thing I need to tell you about. If you like meeting artists, technologists, innovators, and makers, our upcoming Created by Festival is for you. From the week of October 18th to 22nd, teachers and classrooms can get free virtual workshops with one of these makers. 
And then be sure to join us on Saturday, October 23rd for the big Created By Festival. You can get more information and tickets at createdbyfestival.org. We hope to see you there.